tight and Kracheva was able to take it. And then Stevens, very rare for her to pick up a warning for racket abuse. Longest uh, match in time for Stevens since October 2021. She beat Heather Watson and Indian Wells. Hard and deep from Georgie. And it is a break. Yeah, does like to put a lot on at times. Smart, change it up. Take a little bit off. And she does consolidate. Previous ground stroke really crushed it, Georgie. Love it. Back she comes to another break chance. He's a zero, fifteen up. Has a long. And then it was at seven. No break of serve here, Christine. A good pickup on the slice, just making Stevens hit that one extra shot. Last time they faced off, it was in uh, Osaka 2019. That's a shot she likes to hit that running forehand, Georgie. Six love to Georgie, only faced one break chance. Got a good chunk of points one behind the first serve on the clay on the way to making that uh, finale. Although Georgie had their chances, had the chance to serve it out twice in the third set. Turn that rally around. Had to defend. And even that is so, so impressive from Georgie the way she's. That flies on Stevens. 
And the scoreline continues to go. So it is another board in this quarterfinal. It's been a tough one for her so far. And even that came back. Hadn't uh, won a match this season entering Merida. But back comes Georgie. And on the double fault, it's now 10 games in succession. I don't can understand why she's trying to hit that shot. If she needed that slice of luck, given this scoreline, Georgie. Awkward volley for Stevens hit. Just pulled off that one. Just pulled off that one. Did Stevens results? She has won a match without dropping a game twelve years ago. Opponents and everything is working for this evening. Forehand flying on the American. <laughs> Emphatic, it was from Camilla Georgie. Emphatic, it was from Camilla Georgie. Does not drop a single game. 
and makes it through to her first semifinal since last season in Eastbourne. Ladies All the grass. Camila Georgi. Very, very high for a serve. Obviously, uh, getting this type of uh, a scoreline, but Georgie will love her performance. She's going to be carrying so much confidence now into the last four where she could face her fellow Italian in uh, Elisabetta Cacciaretto. That's if Cacciaretto beats Katerina Siniakova.